types of sentences. Course syllabus, block one, types of sentences. Types of sentences. In English, sentences can be classified into four main types based on their functions and structures. They are 1. Declarative sentence 2. Interrogative sentence 3. Imperative sentence and 4. Exclamatory sentence Declarative sentence ends with full stop. A statement ends with full stop means declarative sentence. Interrogative sentence means the statement which ends with question mark is called interrogative sentence. Imperative sentence. The statement with uh, which begins with the verb means imperative sentence. A statement which begins with the verb is imperative sentence. And the exclamatory sentence, the sentence ends with the exclamation marks. Let's see, declarative sentence, definition. A declarative sentence is a type of sentence that makes a statement, provides information or expresses an opinion. Declarative sentences typically end with the period and convey a sense of finality or completeness. They are the most common type of sentence used in written and spoken language. Once again, understand, a yeah, declarative sentence is a type of sentence that makes a statement, provides information or expresses an opinion. It typically ends with the period and convey a sense of finality or completeness. They are the most common type of sentence used in written and spoken language. Here are some examples of declarative sentences. When the sun rises in the east. Two, elephants are the largest land animals. Three, I am going to the store. Four, Water boils at 100 degrees Celsius. 5. She studied for her exams all night. 6. The Eiffel Tower is located in Paris. 7. The meeting is scheduled for 2 p.m. 8. Dogs are known for their loyalty. 9. The earth involved revolves around the sun. 10. I love the smell of fresh coffee in the morning. These are the sentences, examples for declarative sentence. In declarative sentences, the primary purpose is to convey information or express a fact or opinion. The structure of declarative sentences is straightforward with the subject followed by a predicate and they are used in various contexts including academic writing, storytelling and everyday communication. Second one is interrogative sentence. Definition of interrogative sentence. An interrogative sentence is a type of sentence that asks a question seeking information or clarification. These sentences typically begin with the WH word such as who, what, where, when, why, how, etc. or an auxiliary or model verb. The structure of interrogative sentences may vary depending on the intended tone or type of questions. 
Here are some examples of interrogative sentences. WH questions. What is your name? Where did you go yesterday? Who is coming to the party? When will you finish your homework? Why did you choose that opinion? Option. Why did you choose that option? These are the examples from WH questions. Next, SR not type questions. SR not type questions means the question which begins with the helping verb or model auxiliaries. Are you coming to the meeting? Do you enjoy the movie? Have you ever traveled to Europe? Is she your sister? Can you swim? These are the questions which begins with the helping verb means these questions are called yes or no type questions. The answer for this question will be yes or no. If the question begins with the helping verb or Model auxiliaries that is uh, do, does, did, am, is, are, was, where, have, had, has, or can, good, may, might, shall, should. These, these, these helping verbs. If a question begins with the helping verbs or model auxiliary verbs means that an answer of the question will be yes or no. If it is WH questions means the answer will be in a statement. What is your name? If, he, if anyone is raising this question, what is your name? The answer will be in a statement. My name is Raja. Likewise, where did you go yesterday? I went to Chennai. I went to Chennai yesterday. The answer will be in a statement. WH question means... Yes or no type questions means the answer will be yes or no like anyone. Next one is alternative questions. Do you prefer coffee or tea? Would you like pizza or pasta for dinner? Is it raining or is the sun shining? Is it raining or is it raining or is the sun shining? Should I call you now or later? These type of questions are called alternative questions. Two in one. Do you prefer coffee or tea? I, 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 I prefer coffee or I, I prefer tea. Anyone? So these are, these are the questions are alternative questions. Interrogative sentences play a crucial role in communication by... Felicitating the exchange of information and engaging in conversations. Third one is imperative sentence. Definition. An imperative sentence is a type of sentence that gives a command, make a request or offers advice. Imperative sentences are used to convey a sense of urgency or to instruct someone to do something. The subject of an imperative sentence, which is often understood to by you, is implied rather than explicitly stated. Here are some examples of imperative sentences. Already told you, imperative sentences which begins with verb. A sentence with begins with the verb means that sentence is called imperative sentence. Close the door quietly. Please pass me the salt. Pass me the salt. Don't forget to submit your assignment. Listen carefully. To the instructions. Turn off the lights before leaving. Be quiet during the movie. Study for your exams. Help me with the dishes. 
Wait for me at the bus stop. Read the book before the discussion. So you can understand these sentences begins with verb. Some of the sentences begins in negative, sen negative sentence. Don't forget to submit your assignment. So the imperative sentence may be a positive or negative. In imperative sentences, the verb typically comes first and it is in its base form, the infinitive form without to. The tone of imperative sentences can range from polite requests to direct commands. Polite requests to direct commands, depending on the context and the choice of words. Fourth one is exclamatory sentence. Definition. An exclamatory sentence is a type of sentence that expresses strong emotion, surprise, excitement or emphasis. Exclamatory sentences convey a heightened sense of feeling and typically end with an exclamation mark. To denote the intensity of the emotion. An exclamatory sentence is a type of sentence that expresses strong emotion, surprise, excitement or emphasis. Exclamatory sentences convey a heightened sense of feeling and typically end with an exclamation mark to denote the intensity of the emotion intensity of the of the emotion here are some examples of exclamatory sentences what a beautiful sunset i can't believe we won the game how stunning her performance was what an amazing coincidence congratulations on your promotion what a delicious meal this is. Wow! What was an incredible concert. How adorable the puppy, uh, puppies are. I am so excited about the upcoming trip. What a fantastic idea. These are the sentences ends with exclamation mark. If a sentence ends with the exclamation mark means... That sentence is called as exclamatory sentence. In exclamatory sentences, the structure can vary, but the, the key feature is the expression of strong emotion or emphasis. The use of an exclamation mark at the end helps convey the excitement or intensity of the statement. Exclamatory sentences are common in everyday conversation as well as in literature and other forms of written communication when the writer wants to convey a heightened emotional tone. Thank you for watching this video.